Hello, my name is Walter, and welcome back to Adventure Time, Season 9, Episode 14, The Three Buckets? Three Buckets? The Three Buckets? I'm not sure, but The Three Buckets, I'm gonna call it. Uh, well, uh, this episode is uh, picking off from the last episode, I would think. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna try uh, some new series I haven't watched yet. I'm probably gonna try Breaking Bad first, and then... Uh, um, <coughs> I'm gonna try some new series. Uh, probably gonna try Breaking Bad first, and then um, my friend suggested me to watch Attack on Titan, so that's gonna be something I'm gonna try. And then, uh, yeah, the completion of uh, Avatar The Last Airbender is coming soon. Don't worry about that, I just need time uh, to complete the, the finale and everything. And I just wanted to do a little break from uh, Avatar, so maybe I'm gonna do some Samurai Jack first, and then go back to um, uh, Avatar: The Last Airbender. But I just wanted to do Adventure Time because it's been such a long time since I've watched Adventure Time. Uh, so yeah, uh, without further ado, let's go. Adventure time, come on, grab your friends in very distant lands. I can't find the human at the never end of adventure time. It's so weird not seeing the the um, the old new intro when they were in the uh, the alternate timeline. Vuvuzela. <laughs> I think it's Bimo. I can't bear this portal any longer. It was me. I am the Bulbuzela Smasher. Bimo, how could you? No, it was me. I'm the Bulbuzela Smasher. Nectar? No, I'm the Bulbuzela Smasher. All right, really? All right. Well, I'm still getting one. You coming? Nah, me and Fi Fern are supposed to be next to the today. Fern. If anyone tries to stop me, I'll slash their flipping faces off. <laughs> true, true. Okay, well, I'll see you later then. Come on, Bimo. <laughs> Holy cow! Fern, that was perfect. Yep. You're getting new powers like every day now. Let me see you do Jake. No, wait, Ice King. Do Ice King. Come on, man. Don't worry. Imitating uncool people infects you with their loserishness. Oh. Yeah, that rings true. Too bad you didn't develop any coop coop scooping skills. That coop is incredibly disgusting. Actually, about that, I was thinking that instead, maybe you and I could explore some secret ruins I found. Secret ruins? Sweet! Maybe we can still catch up with Jake and Bimo. Or maybe Nectar could come. Hey, Nectar, you want to go on an adventure, buddy? Oh, my glob. Hold on. Oh, my glob. I was thinking maybe just you and me would go. Spend some quality time together. Finn and Fern style. <laughs> yeah, okay. That actually even sounds like something Jake would want us to do. <laughs> Forget it, Nectar! <laughs> Dungeon surprise right before my eyes. No, what the fuck? This is so weird. I can't tell if it's boring or fun. Well, I can. It's boring. I want mm -hmm. the thrill of victory. Who wants to be the same all the time? Come on, man. You know you love it. Come on. One, two, three. Come on. Yeah, this is... One, two, three, shoot. Rock. Paper. Whoa. Whoa. I won this time. What? But that's not fair. Oh. Why is nothing ever fair? His hey, life is unfair, bro. That'd be so weird. Don't, don't call me that. Such a salty. Ah, it's okay. That stuff won't mean a thing. I mean, that stuff don't mean a thing. Hey, come on. We're almost there. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Hey, wait up. Whoop, whoop. Sibling rivalry, man. Sibling rivalry. Whoop, whoop. Whoop, look, look, we're here. Where? You just see a bunch of rocks. Where to blob? But check this out. Whoa, magic key! 
I should chop up a bunch of stubborn so-and-sos to get my hands on this baby. Damn, you've been busy. What? <laughs> Where did the door go? <laughs> they hid the ziggurat in the cliffside. Ah, nice Amazing. ziggurat. Yeah, it's nice to hear Americans say, uh, no, I like I didn't go past the first level. weird I words. It well, it's well we call it z ziggurat as well, but you know, ziggurat, right? Yeah, yeah, we call it ziggurat. Sorry. He doesn't care. I think that's the treasure chamber down there. Why don't you go check it out? I want to study these interesting carvings. Hmm. Fascinating. Oh. Uh. Okay. I guess just follow if you need me. Hey, what's this? Contemporary chair. Contemporary trash. Contemporary meatball. Hey, bad news, Burn. It looks like we got a squatter situation here. I think they got the treasure, but they left some meatloaf behind. Good news is, I know a meatloaf killer. Burn? Burn? I don't think that Fern will ever learn that, uh, you know, brothers. Well, I mean, you could always push that brick out again, you know what I'm saying? Is it because you were abandoned by your father? Custom maker. Oh, rock drill, nice. Yes. Oh. Oh. Huh? You dumped up. How did you get out? What do you think you're doing? I'm weed whacking. You 
I'm weed working. Well, why didn't you put back down your your shirt, though? Confused actually, but uh, that's that's the way uh, Finn works. I guess like Adventure Time works. Um, I don't really know who that is. I guess it's the kind of like the creator of uh, Fern as well. But um, I'm like yeah, but it does make sense like how this turned out and everything because it's it's more on Fern like being jealous of Finn. I think if Finn explained to him that. You know, no matter what it is, I think we we are still e on equal grounds, and you know, Fern doesn't really know how to control his um his emotions, so that's that's just something that he has to he has to learn more about. But I think there is sort of an evil entity in him as well that caused him to kind of do do this kind of thing, and um, yeah, it's more on that Cain and Abel thing. Um, but yeah, this is this is a this is a really solid episode, and I'm I'm kind of looking forward to seeing how how it like wraps up and everything. Cause I really thought that the sixth season was the the big end all, but uh, apparently they had more story to tell. And uh, yeah, Adventure Time is very very random. Like at some points, you know, it spurs the plot, and then some points it's just them, you know, tra traveling and meeting people and it's a lot to say about Finn because it's mostly about Finn and uh, I think that in reality it is actually just Finn and his normal dog you know just going around town maybe and like Finn is technically imagining this whole new world that's my take on Adventure Time at least um, a lot of people are saying he's more under like the post apocalypse, uh, post apocalypse, and I'm like, yeah, it also could be that, but um, you know, a child could imagine that as well, you know, them being alone with the dog and you know meeting other people. It's kind of like where the wild things are, you know, when they need more people, they'll they'll create more people. So uh, yeah, guys, that was about it, and uh, I really like this episode, so. Um, I'll see you in the next video. See you then.